Right now in Nashville, we are under a fair sky. Uh, looking good out there. Check out the scene from Portland. A Shelly Clenard capturing that shot of the sun just over the tree line there. Looking good. Bright sunshine for us today. Rain chances this weekend. It's hit miss scattered tomorrow. Bit more widespread as we make our way into the Sunday. Unfortunately, Mother's Day uh, time frame. But right now we are in good weather shape. Our weather kid LJ. He's got on the light jacket uh, for the cooler weather this morning. 47 to begin the day and that temperature around 70 degrees a little later into the afternoon. So the overall setup today, uh, we've got sunshine and pleasant weather. Meanwhile, scattered showers tomorrow. 3 and 10, 4 and 10 chance, so not everybody will see rain. It's mainly rain, but a rumble of thunder not out of the question. Then rain and thunderstorms on, on Monday, on, on Sunday. It doesn't look like it's, a, it's all day nonstop, but throughout the day, a couple of waves of rain could move in. And then as we head into the afternoon and evening, a couple of those storms could be strong to severe. So that's something that we'll watch for the afternoon and evening hours of Sunday night and could even hold on into Monday morning. So you want to keep up uh, with Heather and Henry uh, over the weekend and they will have the latest and step you through uh, the timing on that. Meanwhile, for you today, 66 Bowling Green, 70 in Nashville, 69 uh, from the Dixon area, 70 out of Camden and then lower 60s at Crossville. A uh, lot like going on around the area this weekend. Strawberry Festival in Humboldt, Tennessee. That's over in West Tennessee. Meanwhile, the Strawberry Festival back in Portland today and tomorrow. A parade is for uh, tomorrow. I mentioned this earlier. They shared a great recipe for strawberry cobbler on Talk of the Town yesterday. Go to the website at newschannel5.com if you want to try that out. The Renaissance Festival is back uh, there at Saturday and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. and and then the uh, Preds hoping to wrap up a playoff spot this weekend. If the Stars lose tonight, they're in, but they will try to do it this weekend against the Hurricanes. Now, heading into Sunday, this is when we'll watch for the severe weather threat. At the moment, it's one out of five, but as we saw yesterday, we were at a one out of five for part of the area, then it became a two out of five. Uh, so stay weather aware going into Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. Here's exact track for Saturday, mostly cloudy, a lot going on. You've got graduations happening out there. Trevecca, Vandy, Lipscomb, I think Lipscomb, uh, but uh, Austin PM, M MTSU. While some are indoors, people want to be out and take some pictures, so they'll be keeping an eye on that. Uh, Nashville, Soccer Club. They've got a game tomorrow at 1230, so they're keeping an eye to the sky for this again, mainly showers. And then as we head into Saturday night, any rain out there with that system pulls out. But then heading into Sunday, here we go. A couple of waves of rain moving across the area. So scattered showers, scattered thunderstorms in association with this. And then as we head into Sunday night and Monday, this begins to pull out. So improving weather for Sunday, a Monday afternoon. How much rain is on the way now? Notice by uh, tomorrow evening, the main the amounts are light, so it's kind of spotty out there. But then those amounts begin to pick up as we head into Sunday. 70 forecast 70 today, 65 tomorrow and then Sunday near 80 next week, 68 on Monday, 69 on Tuesday. Here is our weather artist today, Jalen. Jalen is a student at A.H. Roberts Elementary in Mrs. Bilbrey's classroom. We would love to feature your school as a school of the day. Hit us up, school at newschannel5.com.